Hello, today we're going to be talking to you about GMOs, specifically genetically modified seeds. GMO stands for genetically modified organisms. These modified seeds are produced by companies such as Monsanto. However, just because these are modified seeds doesn't mean that they are better than regular seeds. The modified seeds are supposed to wield a higher yield, but that's not the case. The GMO seeds are expensive, need more water and pesticides, and don't produce seeds. What does this leave you? Seeds that are cost more than they're worth. The first problem is that GMOs are too expensive. GMOs cost way more than regular crops. The second major problem is that it needs more water and pesticides than regular crops. Pesticides are man-made products that drive away pests that eat away at the crops, but they're also unhealthy for the common man, bringing up the price for GMO requirements. Pesticides also cause even more trouble than they are worth. They defertilize the land that it was used on, making it completely useless. Water is needed in every crop, but on estimate, a GMO seed uses much more water than a regular crop. Both the pesticide and extra water cost a rural farmer even more money. The biggest problem with GMOs is that they are not renewable. In a regular crop, there will be seeds that are pr produced so that you can replant the crop after the base crop expires. However, a GMO yields no seeds after it produces its product. The fruits have no seeds and vegetable crops will have no seeds in the flowers. This means you have to buy the GMOs constantly, adding to the already expensive price of the seeds, pesticides, and water. GMOs cause extreme financial harm to the rural farmers of India. Not only are the GMOs impractical and not environmentally friendly, but they also have drastic consequences on the population of India. GMOs are linked to many diseases that occurred in the people who have eaten GMO food. Also, with all the extreme financial costs of the GMO crop, there have been many suicides among the rural farmers in India because of the major debt that the farmers were in. So what can we do? We can switch to organic foods and cut off the supply of cash to the GMO companies. Purchasing organic foods will help farmers stay away from genetically modified seeds. This way we can keep organic foods in the market and genetically modified food out. Together, we can stop the genetically modified seeds. Everything here was done by Duncan, Ben, and Kiva. Thanks for watching!